Hello and welcome back to another episode of our Minecraft survival series. We're on episode 20. Today in this episode we're doing something a little bit different. We spent the last few episodes on our base here. I can just give you guys a little fly around and see what we've we've accomplished so far. We've put this huge circle on the edge. We've started a little statue in the middle. And I really like this place. I really do. But I feel like it is time to head back to our original base and actually actually do something um, in it. Also, I realized the statue's on the wrong way around. I'd never realized that before. <laughs> um, but like I said, we haven't done anything back at our original starting base in a while. So I'm thinking we may as well head over there and do something quite cool. I've got an idea. And I think that this is going to be, I think this is going to be pretty cool. So, we're going to pack up some of our stuff here that we need. And we're going to head right on back over to our original place. You guys can probably tell from the title and the thumbnail that we're going to be doing some old school, like, uh, village sort of stuff we are planning on doing it in this area here we're gonna plan out a village and we're gonna build it up and this thing is gonna be lovely looking um i'm still not sure how exactly i want to do it hey there little guy how you doing i still i'm still not totally sure how i want to do it um i i'd really like to i don't know maybe get like a fort in there maybe some walls um that sort of stuff i'm trying to plan this thing out and uh, that's what I think I'm going to do. Maybe have a cool entrance here. I'm going to plan this thing out. And then we're going to get straight to it. Also, one thing quick. You know we came to this place in the last episode. I thought I'd have a quick look at it. Uh, in spectator mode. Because. Well, oh, I can't go into third person. Because I could still hear the, the, the hog guys. The hoglings. I could still hear them making sounds. Um, when I when I had finished looting and that is because there's so oh look there's a there's a dude here can I spectate him I can <laughs> um because there's so much more here to loot I had no clue look there are three dudes in this corner but yeah there's a lot more to go through and loot here I'll come back here in the future and take this place on all right so quick update we have started leveling out this area and we've been making pretty decent progress it's now, we've now got this uh, big flat area here, which we can do whatever we want. I've still got some stuff to cover up, um, but we're at, in quite a good position now. And uh, I think we may as well start planning what we want to do. Um, I'm going to go on Pinterest and have a look at some, uh, some Minecraft villages, get a little bit of inspiration uh, for what I can do. But I, I have a little bit of an idea in my head. So, I'm going to get planning, and let's see what we can do. Minecraft 1.16 is now officially out, and so we have a hopefully pretty stable, uh, pretty stable world. Wait, there's a wandering trader there. Where'd he go? Yes, with the official update now being out, I think the rest of this episode should be dedicated to actually going exploring in the nether and seeing if we can get ourselves any netherite. Oh, I forgot this was the new part of the update. You can see through glass. Like this. That was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so what we're going to need for this new update, we're going to want to be blasting through the nether rack because, of course, if you didn't know, in the nether... If you um, place down a bed and try and sleep in it, it will then explode. Um, and we want to be able to do that. So we're going to get a ton of our, our wood. Oh, we have a ton of oak here. And we're going to make a ton of beds. Because this stuff is pretty, like, it, it's hard to find, isn't it, Mr. Angolm? It's really hard to find. And then we're just going to grab a ton of wool. I think that's, that's going to be... Oh, we're going to be able to craft here actually um so i'm going to keep this in my inventory make ourselves a crafting table as well and let's head into the nether and see how much we can find and guys i just remembered something so i've been watching i've been checking up a little bit on um 
on actual things to do with the update. I've been, I've been watching some YouTubers. I've been, if you, there's a new trading mechanic with these guys. Look, if you, <laughs> if you throw down gold, they will pick it up. And if I put on a gold helmet, they'll stop attacking me. What have they got in here? Oi! Calm down. Why aren't you taking my gold anymore? This guy does not like me. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh, and look, we got some soul speed boots. If you guys haven't seen my um, my 1.16 blocks video, you'll know that uh, you. If you have seen it, you'll know that soul speed makes you walk faster on soul sand and soul soil, which is pretty cool. It does use your durability for it, but uh, like uh, if you have a XP farm, then that's not gonna be a problem really. But I'm gonna put all of my uh, all of my stuff back in here, so we can get back to finding ourselves some netherite. All right, guys. So we are now at the bottom of the nether. We are at what level 14? I thought we were actually uh, I thought we were lower than we were. But I'm gonna start by making one bed and seeing what this does, because um, actually we're in a bit of a kerfuffle here. But I think if I come in here and I right click on the Ooh. Oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> you know what? I was not expecting it to be um, melted <laughs> today. That's not what I expected, but um, we've started with a ton of lava coming through the ceiling and no netherite in sight. I guess that's probably going to be a theme for this evening. Whoa! I'm going to carry on doing this until I find us some netherite. Uh, hopefully that won't take too long, but chances are it'll probably take me about three hours because that's usually how things in Minecraft go. Oh my, guys, guys, oh my god, there's some there as well. Oh my god. Look, I was, I literally just, just put the next bed in and we've already found three netherite scraps. <gasps> oh boy. Oh, he's up there. Yes. Hidden in the depths, obtain the ancient debris. Oh my god. Whoop, whoop. We found some. We've already found three. This is great. This is great how close it was. Hopefully, uh, finding the rest of it will be just as smooth. It's four? Oh boy. Oh my god. Let's have a little mine around. No, there's, no, there's nothing else. But we're going to carry on going. And ooh, oh. <laughs> no. Oh my god, uh, please do not fall into the fire. The The good thing about netherite is it doesn't burn in lava. Um, I'm actually going to put that back in my inventory because I do, <laughs> I do not want to lose that at all. Lock up this lava first off. <gasps> oh my god, there's some more! <laughs> Can I break this with my fist? No, oh my god, it takes ages with your pickaxe. There are two! Whoop whoop! Guys, I've been doing this for about 20 minutes now and I'm still on 8 ancient debris. We got really lucky at the start. We're in a bit of a dry spot. You guys are my... You guys are my lucky... I don't know. I don't know what to... My, my lucky charms. My lucky charms you are. Yo, look! You... I should just record everything! <laughs> I should just record everything because... I, was, I didn't get any in the time I, I wasn't recording. But then as soon as I start recording, you guys, you guys pull through and, and there we go. We got an, another ancient debris. Whoop, 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 Whoop 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 and uh whoop 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 all right I'm on my last bed will I get the last two pieces of ancient debris that I need. Oh, let's just 
come out a little bit more. Ah, uh, I think we're... I think we've, we've been unlucky with this. That means that for our last two pieces of ancient debris, we're just going to have to do it the old-fashioned way. Mine everything out. Like, I thought this was going to... It was going to be... Yes! Yes! My last two pieces! And there we go. That's all we need. I'm glad that they spawn in, like, veins of two. Okay. So that's all we needed. We can now go home and we can craft ourselves full netherite gear. That's when the textures don't load because because I'm using my custom texture pack. Oh, guys. This is awesome. So, guys, it is time for us to smelt up all of our ancient debris. This is the moment I've been waiting for for about... How, how long have I been? I mean, I've probably done this for about two hours. Two hours. Look how much my my all my armor has gone down by just from get all oh, netherite scraps. So what you do to make netherite is you have to combine gold with the netherite scraps. And there we go. And then I need a smithing table. Um, oh, there we go. Netherite ingot. I can make myself two of these. Look at this. Look at this thing. Oh, isn't it beautiful? It's like a like a more of a black metal. And I need um, netherite. I need a smithing table. I think I'm going to have to fly and get some more. Oh, there's a little turtle. Should we say hi to the turtle? Hello, Mr. Turtle. How are you doing? There we go. Smithing table. Cool. I was, I was right for once. And there we go. So, upgrade gear. So what we do is we, we take our gear and we place it in here with a netherite ingot to make netherite so that is our netherite helmet whoa all right let's do this for all of our gear so if i netherite chest plate netherite boots netherite leggings let's get a pit, our shovel our axe our pickaxe our sword and then finally our silky boy cover the debris get a full suit of netherite armor whoa whoa i feel so cool right now and there we go we've got all of our tools our fully enchanted set of netherite oh come on we gotta we gotta go and have a look at this over over here wow that's so cool and then we've got our sword and we've got our pickaxe all right oh guys this is so sick uh 11 attack damage wow it also doesn't burn in lava now i'm going to show you guys this i'm risking my tools i'm going to risk my shovel to show you guys this okay so if i come over to the edge um, I don't know if blocks to build over. There we go. Our first blocks mined with our netherite stuff. Here we go. If I come over to the edge and I build a little platform out and I throw my shovel, it should bob back up. I think. One hour later. Hello? Shovel? <laughs> yeah! There it is! Look! And we can get our shovel back! <laughs> I, was, I was scared for a moment there! Oh my god! Um, <laughs> I genuinely thought that I just thrown away my <laughs> shovel. But yeah, that's, that's what netherite does. It doesn't burn in lava. So, hello Mr. Enderman. To finish off this episode, we're going to head back over to our, our area. Um... I don't really have anything to bring. Do you have- Oh, oh my god, I forgot that happened. Oh, I was just looking at him in his eyes. You know what, let's head back to the- <laughs> I'm getting away from that enderman. We're gonna see what we want to do with our base. Or our new little village. Our happy little village that we're gonna make. So guys, like I said, I just wanted to quickly talk about what I want to do in this area for- the future what uh we're, we're probably going to do it next episode actually we're going to finish off the uh what we're going to do in this area here um 
But what I want, I want a little fishing area here. So there'll be a little a little dock, maybe even a little uh, barge that they, the uh, people who live in the village use to, uh, to sail off. Basically, it's just going to be a ton of traditional looking, cool, detailed houses that we're going to have in this area. We're going to have uh, paths. They're going to be quite tightly put together. So the path will only be, I don't know, three blocks wide, maybe one block um, depth. And then uh, for the front of the houses. And this will go along and then we'll have a cool town hall. Now, I found a Instagram account that posted a picture of the Town Hall 7 from Clash of Clans on their Instagram page in Minecraft. And it's, but Town Hall 7 is my favorite looking Town Hall in Clash of Clans. I'll put a picture up on screen for you guys because Town Hall 7, ah, oh, beautiful, perfection. Um, and I, I really want to use it for my extra Town Hall. So maybe we'll put it over here or over here maybe. I want it somewhere that's going to be, you know, like the, in the limelight. So maybe we'll have it over here in this little cove area and then i just want a ton of little houses um and we can move our villagers or at least some of our villagers into this area but that's for next episode i just want to thank you guys so much for watching this one's a little bit of a shorter episode than usual uh i wanted to do something a little bit more chilled today just because i've been doing quite long episodes and i think you guys will enjoy a shorter sort of episode but anyway guys thank you so much for watching if you do think that this video deserves a thumbs up, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!